Do you separate your trash and your recycling? Do you litter when there is no trash can next to you? If so, you are doing this planet a disservice. Fortunately, BU Cleanup Crew is here to assist. Each week, the Bradley Cleanup Crew meets to pick up litter on the Peoria streets surrounding the campus. Here with more on the story is our field reporter, Sheridan Hertig. Despite Bradley's commitment to maintaining a clean campus, littering is still a persistent issue in the surrounding neighborhoods. But there are ways for Bradley students to do their part and help clean up. BU Cleanup Crew is dedicated to picking up trash left in areas around Bradley's campus. And I'm here with Malini Vijaysingha to learn more about it. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so can you tell me a little bit about what BU Cleanup Crew is? Yes. Um, so the club is just a student group. We meet once a week and we pick up litter, like you said, on the streets of Peoria surrounding Bradley's campus. So we're usually on Western or Main Street or University, um, but we'll occasionally take little field trips and go to other places in Peoria that members of the club have noticed need a little bit of attention. That's amazing. And so can you tell me how it started? Yeah. Um, so I'm a senior this year. Uh, it began during my junior year. At the start of my junior year, um, the impetus of the club was I used to pick up litter uh, at the city of Peoria pretty often. I'm on the tennis team and my assistant tennis coach, they call him the litter czar down at the city. And so I used to go with the Peoria litter, uh, the Peoria mayor litters committee, the Peoria mayor's litter committee. And um, we would pick up litter like once a week on Mondays. And it was just a small group of city employees. And I just thought that it would be a good thing to bring to Bradley for a number of reasons, um, including the positive impact on the environment in the city, but also just to connect Bradley students more with the Peoria community. Um, so that was kind of the impetus for the club, and we started at the beginning of last year. Well, congratulations for starting this entire thing. And why do you think it's so important for students to get involved in an organization like this? Yeah, um, that's kind of a twofold question, I think. The first part is that um, I really believe in reducing our impact on the environment as much as we can. Um, being first world citizens, we have a really large impact. Um, and so to help out in any way, I think is a really positive thing. Um, and in addition to that, I think it's important to help out your community, no matter uh, what community that is, where you're a part of. Um, but I also think that there's a little bit of a deficit um, in terms of bridging the gap between the BU community and the wider Peoria community. So I thought that this would be a great way. Students always are looking to volunteer and I think when they're presented the opportunity to get off campus and make an impact, um, that they typically enjoy doing that. Um, and so I just thought that it would be not only a good way to help the environment and the community, but also a way to um, connect Bradley students. You know, we're only here for four years and so to get off the hilltop and to actually uh, feel like you're a part of the greater Peoria community as opposed to just the BU community. I think that that's a pretty good thing. So. <laughs> right. So unfortunately, I only have time for one more question, but I would like to know when and where will this, uh, I know you guys have a meeting on Friday, so when and where will that be taking place? Um, yeah, we meet every Friday at 9 a.m., changes by semester. Um, this Friday we'll be meeting in front of Whittier Primary. So we're actually doing a cleanup with a bunch of second graders from Whittier, and that's at the corner of Fredonia and Cooper. If anybody wants to come, that would be great. Um, but we typically meet in the market lobby, and we'll also, our last cleanup will be the study day cleanup, uh, which will be at noon on Wednesday study day. So if people want to come to either of those, we'd love to see anyone out there. Thank you such, so much, Malini. And reporting live from BUTV in the Student Center, I'm Sheridan Hertig.